In this segment of the Word tutorial, we are going to learn about using the Editor tool in Microsoft Word from Office 365. This is a new tool in recent editions of Word. So let's say we have this document or report. We have made changes to it. We have applied some formatting to it and things of that nature. And now we want to check it for certain grammar and other options. Now remember, some of this grammar and is also covered on the review area, and I'll try to cover those later. But since we are early on in the Home tab, we are presented also with this tool for the editor. If you click on Editor, it's going to check for spelling in the document, and it's going to identify the grammar areas, and also various refinements such as for clarity, for conciseness, formality, punctuation, and things of that nature. Now you'll notice here that certain things are with a check mark. That's because this was a document that I retrieved, so it was a published document. If you click on the spelling area, there's no reference for this first one. Let's go to the next one. Again, there's no reference here as well, and no reference. So there are no spelling errors. It's just bringing things that are not normal. So you can ignore those or ignore them all the time and then move to the next thing. Then you return back to the editor here, and then we are going to check it for grammar. You click on grammar. It's recommending or it's suggesting to use thus comma. So put a comma in there. You are making those changes and applying them directly by simply pushing those suggestions or acknowledging those suggestions here. Then you come back to the editor and then you go under the punctuation conventions or clarity and you make those changes as well. Once you deal with these suggestions, then you can close the editor 